Today's video is sponsored by Quantic Bank. Now, if you're like me and you're self-employed or you're a gig worker or you're somebody that makes you know, a lot of cash but you don't have a lot of documented income or let's say you're a freelancer or some sort of small business owner and you have inconsistent income, then that's the reason why today I wanna to talk to you about some flexible mortgage solutions that Quantic is offering. Now, I personally use a mortgage solution very similar to what Quantic is offering because when you are self-employed Employed, it can be very difficult to obtain a conventional loan. So if you have good credit and you have a significant down payment available to purchase a home, but you've had trouble qualifying with other banks because of your income documentation, then look no further than Quantic Bank. Quantic offers community development loans that make the mortgage process simple. Whether you have inconsistent or difficult to document income, they may be able to help you make your home purchase or refinance a reality even when other lenders have turned you away. So who is Quantic Bank and what makes them such a great solution, especially for small business owners? Well, Quantic has been around since 2009 and they are a national digital bank lending in all 50 states. And what really sets them apart is their CDFI status, which is a US Treasury designation and stands for Community Development Financial Institution. Being a CDFI means that they are one of less than 3% of all banks that can accept flexible documents needed for a home loan. Their CDL or community development loans are truly unique and can help borrowers get approved for a mortgage based on their overall credit profile, not just their bank statements, tax returns, and W-2. So why is it hard for some well-qualified borrowers to get a mortgage? Let's go over what other lenders require you in order to get approval for a conventional loan. First off, most are gonna look at your DTI or what's called your debt to income ratio. They do this in order to make sure that you make enough to cover expenses, and they also require your last two years of W-2s tax returns, and they want to verify income with your two most recent bank statements to make sure that your income is actually being deposited. And this is where it gets tricky for most small business owners, investors, or commission-based professionals and others who can't show consistency of income year over year. Now let's go over what Quantic needs in order to qualify you for their LightDoc community development loan. Good credit or better is required, and so a minimum credit score of 660 is the minimum. Your credit score will also impact your required down payment because the higher your FICO score, the lesser the down payment will be, but the minimum is always going to be 20% down. They also accept 100% gift funds and loan amounts that go as high as $3 million. With their LightDoc program, income verification for self-employed borrowers will need a 12-month CPA, tax preparer, or accountant prepared P&L document, and you only need to be self-employed for one year. This program accepts Airbnb and short-term rental income as well and requires just one month worth of bank statements. For non-self-employed borrowers, you'll need a verification of income and you'll be qualified based on your current income which helps if you recently started making more money. Lastly, their LightDoc program can be used for both owner-occupied and investment properties. For more information on Quantic Bank and the LightDoc Community Development Loan, or to see if you pre-qualify, you can visit them online at quantic.com mortgages, and I've added the link in the description below.